night, a 20-year-old man accused of attacking Jewish teenagers in Brooklyn is under arrest and facing hate crimes charges. It comes amid a rising number of anti-Semitic attacks in the city. The latest target, a pizza shop in Manhattan. CBS 2's Jessica Layton has this. You understand the problem uh, right now? The problem is hate, and it quite literally showed up at the door of this kosher pizzeria Tuesday morning. It's not good, you know. It's not good, not good. The manager was one of the first to see the mess left behind by a brick thrown through the glass of his Upper East Side restaurant. This is just ab abominable. I am just shocked. I'm disgusted. Somebody I work with said she doesn't feel comfortable wearing her Jewish star around. It's the latest in a string of anti Semitic crimes across the city. The NYPD says there have been 80 such crimes so far this year, compared to 62 this time last year. Mayor de Blasio reminded New Yorkers they'll see more police outside Jewish houses of worship after this shul on Staten Island was vandalized. That incident is unacceptable. Anyone who commits a hate crime, we're going to find them. The NYPD Hate Crimes Task Force says it's found one of the men involved in this attack on Jewish teens in Borough Park, Brooklyn, this weekend. 20 year old Daniel Shakit of Brooklyn was arrested and charged with aggravated harassment. You want to get stuck in your face? And the suspect seen and heard going on a tirade in front of a synagogue on Avenue S in Brooklyn was also caught. I want no help. You. I want no help. Watch him throw a punch at one of the members, a 67-year-old federal agent in uniform. In that case, the victim lives only a few feet away from where he was punched in the face. He is home from the hospital, and he told us he's okay. Neighbors remain shaken up and worried for each other. In Sheepshead Bay, Brooklyn, Jessica Layton, CBS 2 News.